How's it going, guys? So you are here today because you just downloaded Assassin's Creed Valhalla, you are trying to play it, and you get stuck at a pesky little screen where it goes nowhere. This is kind of known as the splash screen or the, the initial boot up screen. You get stuck here. Now, personally, I just spent about two hours trying to fix it, and I just figured out my fix. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and close it because it will actually launch for me. Let me use the task manager, force it to quit real quick. Get that guy closed. But... So if you're having this issue where you're stuck at that screen and you cannot even get into the game, unfortunately, the fix is probably going to be one that you do not like. And it's more of an explanation on why it works that way. But you got to follow me here. So generally speaking, this should only be an issue for people who are trying to install Assassin's Creed onto a different drive. And what I mean by that is if you go to your file explorer and I go to my computer, you can see all these devices and drives right here. So I have my C drive, D drive, E, F, G, I, all these different type of drives. Now your operating system, which is how your computer runs. So if you're on Windows or Mac or whatever you're on, your operating system that actually makes your computer work will always be on your C drive. And you'll have folders like program files, program files 86 right there that I'm highlighting, uh, Windows, Windows apps. Your C drive will always have these. I have a D drive which is my external hard drive that's a big old three terabyte drive. And I was trying to install Assassin's Creed onto my external games here with all my other stuff here. That is where I was getting that infinite load screen that, that where it wouldn't even start up. So unfortunately, the solution for this is you have to install Assassin's Creed onto your C drive where your operating system is. So there's two things you need to verify when you install Assassin's Creed, at least through Uplay. This is where I had this specific issue. You need to have the um, Ubisoft, Ubisoft app. You need to have that on your C drive. So if you look here, I'll go back. Program files 86. If I go down, the Ubisoft launcher is right here that I'm highlighting and I click in. And you can see the game launcher here and it has everything it needs. And then if you go into games, Assassin's Creed is on there. So you need to have both the Ubisoft game launcher and Assassin's Creed downloaded on your C drive. Otherwise, this game will not launch. So again, I previously installed Assassin's Creed onto my D drive, my external drive. It did not work. Wouldn't launch. Got stuck there. I uninstalled it. I reinstalled it to my C drive, along with the Ubisoft app and everything where your operating system resides. And the game launches perfectly without issue. And just to prove that to you, of course, I will let the game fully launch as is so you can see that. So unfortunately... A lot of people are installing this game onto external hard drives because maybe they have an SSD um, as their C drive on an operating system. Um, so the solution is, unfortunately, you're going to have to clear some space. You're going to have to find a way to get Assassin's Creed. See, launches right there. You're going to have to find a way to get Assassin's Creed onto your C drive, whether it's an SSD, a hard drive, it should not matter. Assassin's Creed needs to be installed on the C drive along with the Uplay app. So. Unfortunately, the fix is not one we would all like to hear. You play, you're kind of trash for making us do this, but that is the solution. And it took me about two hours of troubleshooting to figure out. So hopefully this helps you guys out. Just kind of a quick, hey, here's how you fix it, even if it is a really crappy solution. So hopefully this helps you guys out. Let me know down in the comments if it works for you. Or hey, if you find a solution where you can keep it on a different drive, please let us know in the comments and I'll pin that so everyone can see that. Appreciate you guys watching and I hope to see you in the next one.